As somebody who went into this just to be an astrophysicist, uh, and you've ended up being a rock star astrophysicist, let me start with that. Do you like the fame that comes with this, or do you accept this just goes with the I territory? Don't, uh, yeah, I don't, uh, I don't have feelings about it. Uh, I, really, what I want to do is go back to the lab. Uh, once I know others are on this landscape of, of sort of public discourse of science, and I wanna, I'll back up, sneak into the lab, and then you won't even know I'm missing, and I can do science again. <laughs> the way this all occurred was, no, there I was, people would, you know, the news, folks like you or others, would need a sound bite because some cosmic phenomenon or event would take place. And so you go to your local planetarium or whoever who has some expertise, so I was called early on. And they said, oh, tell us about this new planet or Pluto. And I'd give them a couple of lines and they liked it. And then they came back for more. And, but I remember distinctly the first exoplanet, 1995. It was NBC News. They sent an action camera to the Hayden Planetarium, uh, you know, the, mm. the, the, the van, with action cam van, mm. to the pla planetarium. And I gave my best professorial explanation <laughs> for how you discover exoplanets, where they, they orbit their host star and the host star jiggles in response to the, or to the, to the gravity. And I talked about the spectra. I gave, but I looked that evening, the only thing that ended up on, <laughs> on the news was me doing this with my body. <laughs> <laughs> I said, okay. So he didn't come for the lecture. <laughs> they came for a sound bite. And so I, so I went home and I practiced sound bites because if that's what you want, why don't I give that to you? And so I just took random words from the universe, black hole, quasar, Saturn, uh, Pluto, s s stars. And I came up with two or three sentences that would be informative, make you smile, you know, you want to enjoy the learning and then make you want to come back for more. And then when I started doing that, then floodgates opened 